something pure about being out in the field early in the morning, not a soul in sight. It's times like these I appreciate my job the most. Freedom of being out there, finding yourself in different types of situations, challenges you to be flexible, which is what I demand of my equipment. Often these challenges can take me into areas that may not be covered by a network. In this case, having the ability to set up a base station for my corrections makes my life easier. And if I don't have to feel like I need a computer science degree to do it all, you got my attention. That was one of the reasons why I initially looked at Leica Captivate. I just wanted something that had powerful enough features but at the same time felt natural and familiar, so creating something like a digital terrain model of a field is as easy as it should be. You never know what condition you find things in when you arrive at your job. You have to walk through physically punishing environments, cross water, get stuck in swamp-like conditions, make your way through poison oak, all while mapping utilities in obscure, out-of-sight locations that were not meant for people to wander off in. At those times, safety becomes your number one objective. With safety and the job of my mind, the equipment sometimes has to take a back seat. As much as I hate to admit it, I've dropped my controller in GS14 into a creek while slipping on a rock. It happens, but no worries, it kept working. In the end, it's surveying. Stuff does happen, and the last thing you want to have to do is worry about your gear. If cuts and bruises bother you, then this job is not for you. As a surveyor on a construction site, you're often first in, last out, which gives you the opportunity to see things really come to life. I'm often amazed when I come back the next day and discover a new addition to the site while checking into my control point. As much as I love being a part of the construction process, getting in and out as quick as you can is key. Speed becomes your best friend, because you don't want to hold things up. Also, safety plays a big role, and reducing time spent on a site just works in your favor. In any case, I have come to rely on my GS14 speed to get it done. However, there is no better situation in which I fully appreciate the speed and ease of use when I'm on a job. That is doing line work on a road. Especially when you find yourself out there on the center line. It's times like that when things like the zigzag feature in Captivate has my back. Automating the repetitiveness can really help pick up the speed, but also allow me to keep my eyes on the road rather than on the controller all the time. If you think nature can be unpredictable, then you haven't surveyed a road. Speed is obviously important. But accuracy and precision is what gets the job done. If the data is garbage, you might as well dust off your resume. I'm always conscious of the fact that the measurements I provide impact people's lives to one degree or another. When I'm setting control for a big highway project where the geometry of a tight turn affects driver's safety, I want to make sure I'm doing the job right. At the end of the day, when I finish, despite the car or two that got a bit too close for comfort, I feel a sense of pride and accomplishment. I do it for the love of the job. When my equipment helps me do it well, I feel like a surveyor. <laughs>